Now, time now to take a look at the fighter of the year and who made the most of 2006. Was it arguably the pound for pound king in Pretty Boy Floyd as he cruised to victories over Zab Judah and Carlos Baldemir? Was it Manny Pacquiao's quantity in three victories? Or how about Bernard Hopkins moving up and taking out Antonio Tarver? Or perhaps even someone else? You be the judge. In a discussion about fighter of the year, immediately Manny Pacquiao's name leaps to mind. To start it off, he avenged his previous loss to Eric Morales via 10th round stoppage and then won the rubber match in a brutal three rounds in November. Factor in his decent win over the lanky Oscar Larios and the Pac-Man has to be in the front runner for this award. What about his arch rival in the pound for pound ratings, Floyd Mayweather Jr.? Pretty Boy may have boxed only twice during 2006, but both performances were noteworthy outpointing both Zab Judah and then Carlos Valdemir, a win that came over a much bigger and stronger man. Winky Wright deserves to also be mentioned, thanks to a much disputed draw with middleweight champion Jermaine Taylor and a near shutout over Ike Corte. Though not as flashy as Pacquiao or Mayweather, Winky gets the job done like few others. At heavyweight, Vladimir Klitschko went a long way towards making a lot of people think he just might be the best big man on the planet today. With crushing wins over both tricky Chris Bird and the previously unbeaten Calvin Brock, Dr. Steelhammer did enough to be nominee among Fighter of the Year candidates. And finally, ageless Bernard Hopkins, who fought only once this year. But what a performance, moving up from middleweight to light heavy and doing away with the betting favorite and champion, Antonio Tarver, in June. So is it the mix of quantity and quality provided by the Pac-Man, the flash of Pretty Boy, Winky's Right Stuff, Vlad the Impaler, or the Ageless Executioner? It's up to you to decide. And we do want to hear from you. In the new year, we're going to hand out awards in a bunch of different categories. we got the Fighter of the Year, the Fight of the Year, Knockout of the Year, Upset of the Year, Canadian Fighter of the Year. Let us know who should win in this corner at tsn.ca. So we'll look back when we